It hasn't been too bad of another couple of days and uh, we look to see another two days where temperatures will be just slightly above average. A lot of sunshine. Some are still with us. Highs uh, heading into the day tomorrow up around the lower 80s and then we'll do that again heading on to Wednesday. I think we might see a few upper 70s to go along with that, but the days that we are going to turn hot Wednesday, Thursday and Friday, especially Thursday as we can get up closer to about 90 degrees. Now highs today made their way into the low 80s around Bremerton, lower 80s in Tacoma. Outside of Puget Sound, we saw a few more of those 70s like in Everett, Arlington, Mount Vernon topping off at 77. Even the coast today saw some fairly warm conditions. Now as we get on a to the night. We're already back down into the 60s at 67. North winds coming in at 7 miles per hour, but still a beautiful evening. A lot of traffic out there uh, going home from the Sounders match, which was earlier this evening. Uh, it should be uh, hopefully a lot easier to go out tomorrow morning, especially with temperatures that are going to be around the upper 50s to low 60s. Right now they're sitting in the mid 60s and do look to cool down just a bit more into the night. Now what's going to help to keep things from really heating up the next two days at least will be a couple of features that will move on through. First one right here that's moving up into British Columbia that will help to bring in some clouds as we head into the latter part of the night, but also it's going to bring in a reinforcing dose of more than onshore flow. Keep that going at a decent clip. The next one right behind that's going to do the same thing heading on into Tuesday, but once we start to see that weaken to a certain degree into the mid and latter part of the week, we already showed you some of the highs. We had excessive heat watches already out for the center part of the state where highs could reach anywhere between the upper 90s to possibly 105. That starts up at noon on Wednesday heads until 11 p.m. heading into or Friday evening. So skies as we go into the night will feature yes, some of those clouds which are going to move in and move out of here for Puget Sound. Tomorrow out along the coast, maybe a bit more of that cloud coverage sticking around than what we had earlier into the day. So as we go on into tomorrow night and into Tuesday, guess what? We're going to repeat this again with a few more clouds around Puget Sound early into Tuesday, but skies will turn sunny yet again by the afternoon. More sun too, also expected out along the coast. And then we start to heat up for Wednesday, 86, 89, the hottest day of the week on Thursday. And then we start to fall back a little bit on Friday and see more comfortable conditions as we head on into the weekend.